Welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Michelle Madrigal. If you are new to my channel, please don't forget to click subscribe and thank you so much for tuning in. All right, so for today's vlog, I am sharing with you guys my favorite healthy drink recipes. And I will be using Amaste countertop blender and Amaste coffee machine. As you may all know, I do love my coffee so this coffee machine is perfect for me it has three brewing methods if you want it to be mild medium or strong it also has a reusable coffee filter very environment friendly so you don't run out of coffee filter so this blender is good for both hot and cold dishes it has a safe power off function and a time function as well you can do so much with this blender as you can see it has different functions you can crush ice you can make hard juice smoothie soup corn juice baby food super super amazing this is definitely very useful for your family all right so let me share with you guys my first recipe Alright, while we are brewing the coffee, I will share the ingredients for my pumpkin spice latte. You will need milk, half a cup of milk. We are going to need some cinnamon, pumpkin pie spice, a tablespoon of pumpkin puree, half a teaspoon of coconut sugar, low glycemic. So now we are going to go over this way to heat up our milk and pumpkin mixture all right so half a cup of milk that's good i'm just eyeballing it <laughs> and then you get a tablespoon of pumpkin puree a dash of cinnamon and pumpkin spice this is my favorite holiday drink Make sure that the fire is on low to medium. And just mix it up. And we're going to add, as our sweetener, we are going to add a, te a teaspoon of coconut sugar. You could also use um, coconut milk, macadamia milk. It's really up to you. But I do have almond milk, so that is what we're using. Probably just simmer it for like two minutes. Make sure that everything is melted and smooth. All right, so our pumpkin milk is finished. We are going to grab our coffee, our freshly brewed coffee. We're probably gonna need half a cup. And we are going to mix our pumpkin mixture. There we go. And just mix it up. You can top it with whipped cream. Whipped cream and a little bit of cinnamon on top. There we go. And a little bit of pumpkin pie spice. Here is your pumpkin pie spice latte. My favorite holiday drink. All right, recipe number two. We are making my favorite breakfast smoothie. Uh, we will need collagen protein, frozen tropical fruit. So I have strawberries, mangoes, and pineapples. A cup of spinach, chia seeds, ice, and cocoa water 
All right, y'all. So let's put our fruits. I love mangoes. Cocoa water, it ha it's good for hydration. It has electrolytes. Maybe just a little bit, maybe half a cup. We'll add some ice and the spinach. And we will add some superfoods. This is good, anti-inflammatory, antioxidants. It has some protein as well. So we're gonna put one teaspoon. We'll do a table of chia seeds. And we are going to add some collagen. Collagen, 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 collagen peptides. <laughs> this one has 18 grams of protein. It's good for your um, gut, for your skin, your joints, and your bones. So two scoops for one serving. All right, but I a smoothie. All right. Fancy. So it does have a time function. So I did set it for 20 seconds. Yeah, yeah. I am impressed. So this is my breakfast smoothie. Oh, you guys. Spinach to add more vegetables in my diet. You can make this for your kids too, if they don't like veggies. Another tip, mamas, here you go. All right, so for recipe number three, we are making a post-workout smoothie. Very simple and easy. I am using a vegan protein, vanilla flavor. You can use whatever you like. Easily digestible. It has 20 grams of protein and they use pea protein isolate. We're gonna use a cup of almond milk. Use whatever milk you like, non-dairy, 2% um, milk, it's up to you. Ice, cocoa powder just to sprinkle on top, a teaspoon of peanut butter, and banana. Let's go. One full banana Ooh. into the blender and then a cup of almond milk and then ice. Peanut butter or any nut butter has a lot of good fats but you have to be very mindful when you consume them because two, serving size is two tablespoons. It's 190 calories, but it's very good to add to your smoothie. So this is gonna be like a banana nut um, smoothie. And we're just gonna top it off with some cocoa, cacao. So one teaspoon. And then a scoop of vegan protein. You can use um, whey protein as well. And we like this vanilla flavor. All right, that is it. Let's do 20 seconds. Let's go. Very powerful. <laughs> yes. All right, so this is my post-workout shake. It's good for recovery. And to increase your protein intake throughout the day. Mm, I can smell the banana. And we are just going to sprinkle it with a little bit of cocoa powder on top. All right, you guys, here is your banana nut protein smoothie. Mmm, so good. Try my smoothie, my breakfast smoothie. Very refreshing. Love it. All right, you guys. So that is it for today's vlog. Thank you so much for watching. And if you want to buy my new kitchen essentials, which are the Amaste countertop blender and Amaste coffee machine, please click the link in the description box. Please let me know if you guys create one of my healthy drink recipes. Tag me and I will see you guys next week. Bye.